Hi guys, Spencer Three Dollars here. Welcome back to some more Dog Dollars. We're trying to get to Arena Five now. So it seems since my first video, when I pushed up to Pekka's Playhouse with level two, there are a lot of people now trying to push as high as they can with the lowest levels, and it's a lot of fun. I've seen a level one. He's just hit a thousand trophies. Unfortunately, I can't bring you his replays because he obviously can't get into a clan. Now we do also have somebody in Lost Phoenix who's using a similar deck to this. He's certainly overtaken me as a level four. He's switched the archers for spear goblins, and he's switch the knight for a pekka so i'm going to show you some of his replays probably in the next video might be useful for some of you guys perhaps those cards are more upgraded than the ones i'm using it's not a three crown strategy normally wins with one or two crowns and i might have to switch up because it's starting to get harder and harder to get the three crowns it's getting more and more risky i might have to start playing a little bit more safe but i'm going to try and get 500 three crown wins first another question you guys have been asking is what if i don't have a witch i'm also going to give you a deck that you can use for pushing which doesn't have the witch. Some of you don't have it or you have a low level witch. So this is just a replay before we go into a couple of live raids. We're going to try and push to Arena 5. I've been attacked by a Giant Larry. Now he is one of my least favourite opponents. Giant Larry and recently the Minion Horde. Because the Minion Horde, level 6 and level 7, which is what people seem to have around where I am, takes my witch down very easily. She used to be able to destroy them. Now she can't. Uh, my witch isn't really close to being upgraded. I need a few more cards for that. Uh, so I might have to start using my arrows and my fireball more, which you guys know I hate doing. It feels like a waste of elixir. Might be something that I have to do. I'm defending here now. Pushing on the right hand side. Don't want him to take my king tower. It is the risk when you're trying to go for three crowns every time. Got my very weak meat shield. He's already been destroyed, but managed to sneak a giant in just in time. He's crept in front of my witch and my musketeer. But as as I was just saying, Minion Horde comes along, destroys my witch. My musketeer is pretty much damaged. I've tried to get my archers out just to stop the final minions. Luckily, we've got to this tower. Giant's going to take it down. And this giant, he doesn't have a lot of health, so you've got to decide, is it worth backing him up? Because your troops are going to be undefended very quickly. I did go for it. I decided to drop my musketeer. Manages to get rid of that dragon. Probably get a few shots off against this king tower. Soften it up a little bit. Give us a chance. Now, times two elixir is when this deck really comes into its own. This is when you can sometimes get out two witches. Two witches is so OP. And it will deal with minion hordes very easily. But he sent another giant Larry and a hog. Distracting his giant Larry and the hog with my knight. Trying my best to try and direct all of these troops anywhere but towards my king tower. Snuck some archers in behind my king tower. Managed to kill the hog. But look at this. I've just about kept my witch alive. But no, she's been destroyed by the big bomb. Luckily, it was a trade for trade. So I've got one archer remaining. He lost all his troops as well. But look at my king tower. It's in a bit of trouble right now. Time to push on. Time to get his king tower. Let's go. Oh, he sent a hog. Bad idea. I've got enough troops to defend that hog. Luckily, doesn't get a single hit off on my king tower. Which means he's going to be a bit defenseless now. He doesn't have much elixir. He's elixir starved. Got my giant in, got my musketeer in, got my witch in, and my second witch is going to clinch it. Two witches, minion horde, no longer a problem. And this king tower is going to go down so fast, it's unbelievable. Dropped his giant Larry, but that's not going to help him. It's too late. Oh, run out of power. Okay, guys, I'm going to charge up. We're back in a minute. Let's try and push in to Arena 5. This is going to be kind of difficult. There's a lot of people trying it. Okay, guys, we're charged up. We're not going to run out of power. Let's go for this. Arena 5, here we come. Oh, it's giants from brrr, motorboaters. <laughs> Let's try and take this boy down. Right, I'm going to let him go first. I normally like to let people go first, but I'm just so impatient. I'm one of the most impatient people in the world. This looks like a waste. Fire arrows against the giant and the tower, but it is doing damage to them both. And my elixir will be on full by the time his giant comes. What I don't want is my crowd of troops to meet his giant on his side of the map. Because if they do that, they're going to be getting pummeled by his tower at the same time. And that trade for trade, I'm going to lose. Oh, he's coming with a wizard and some... But I'm going to have to... Oh, I'm going to have to fireball these. Not a bad fireball. Managed to get his wizard... He's really gone for it, so maybe I'm just going to have to re respond by really going for it on the left-hand side. If he gets my tower, I'll try and make sure I get it. That was probably a waste of arrows. Should be able to get this tower, can we? Yeah, we're going to get this tower. What have I got? Cards. Yes, my giant's ready. Get him in the middle. 
Destro oh, and here we go again. It's the Minion Horde. I hate you, Minion Horde. Minion Horde's got my witch, but my Mus Musketeer's still alive. Giant's going to make it to his King Tower. Doubt we'll take it this go, but let's try for it. What's he doing? Why is he not placing it? He's always oh, used a free spell. That's probably not an excellent idea. Managed to get rid of my Giant, though. Probably not the card I would have placed. Probably soften him up to halfway. He's going to get rid of my witch with his barbarians. Level 7 barbarians. Wow, these levels are getting higher and higher. Luckily, I've got my bomber card waiting for him. I can get rid of this. Get some archers in to help it. The archers just top off the damage done by the bomber. Make sure the barbarians don't get any damage off against my tower. Right, I need a double meat shield. So I've got my knight ready. And I've got giant card out next. So I can actually get a double meat shield here. Here we go. This should be good. I think on this push we can get his tower. He's going to be... Oh, there it is again. The minion horde. Going to use my arrows. Going to get rid of it. That has ruined my entire push, that minion horde. I hate them. And a wizard. Let's fireball him. We'll fireball him. We'll get the tower as well. Regroup. Right, what's he on? 855. That's not going to take long. Maybe four or five hits from my musketeer should do this. See if we can get up there. He doesn't seem to have any... Oh, oh, here he comes with his balloon. If I get my musketeer on the left, this will at least make sure his balloon doesn't get to... Oh, look at that. So he's tried to freeze me. That's another advantage of putting your musketeer on your push side. It means they can't freeze it. Balloon's not going to get my king tower. I've kind of given away my tower, but I'm going for it now. I'm going for the three. Let's do this. Got two witches out, so his minion odd is not going to be able to stop me. Try to use the arrows. No good. Two musketeers. Oh, he's frozen me. Quick, get some archers before his minions come. Do it, do it, do it. Oh, just in time. Where's his minion? Oh, there they are. No problem. We got him. Sorry, giants. From motorboaters. You're done. As Malt would say, he is well and truly done. Does that take Does that take us into Arena 5? Please tell me we're in Arena 5 now. Are we there? No, we're five away. One more. Okay, guys. I was playing and I wasn't actually recording, but I've got into Arena 5. Here we are, 1,413. We're finally here. Arena 5 for the win. So we're going to push on to Arena 6. But let's go again. This will be my first win, I think, in Arena 5. Let's see if we can do this right now. Who have we got? This is Keb Kebabibi. Kebabibi. Fireball those barbarians. Might as well get some damage off on his tower. These barbs won't really do a lot to me. I can get my witch in behind my tower. Oh, no. Gonna have to use my arrows. Oh, he's sending a hog as well. This guy's really going for it. They're a lot more aggressive at this trophy level. They do a lot less silly things. My tower is... Pro oh, no. I've managed to keep my tower going. Right. Let's go. For let's re respond. Send everyone. Let's go for this. He's got a level 2 witch. Same as me, though. I'm, a bit, I'm feeling a bit elixir-starved. I need another meat shield. My my knight's going to go down. Come on, bomber. Get rid of it. That's right. Okay. Oh, it's a wizard. It's a wizard. That is my pushover. Oh, yes, we got his tower, though. Right, what should we do about this wizard? It's, yeah, it's not worth fireballing him. It's a waste of a fireball because he's... All, oh, wait a minute. There's a prince now. Okay, I will fireball him. I was gonna, just, just fireballing that wizard on his own would have been a bit of a waste. He was already half-damaged. Might as well do a bit of damage to that prince, though. Right, let's push on back. My tower's still alive. That's not bad going. Oh, here they come. It's the barbarians. Let's see what we can do about these guys. Try and distract them. I don't want to lose my witch. Is my giant going to stay alive? Need my giant to stay alive? Let's try and get something in to help him. And here it is, the minion horde again. Is my witch going to get these down? Come on, she's got a bit of breathing room. Get some arrows in to help her. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, she survived. But I've got no, that's cost me so much elixir to keep her alive. I guess this push is a bit of a struggle now. Might fireball this witch in the tower. Just do a little bit of damage and then sit back, get a little bit more elixir. Oh, here we go. Double elixir time. My favorite time. Ah, oh, goblin barrel. Probably should have sent my bomber. Was my bomber available then? I didn't see. I was kind of in a bit of a rush. Giant card, exactly what we need for my witch. He's got my tower. I think he's in trouble. Oh, wizard again. Oh, oh, he's, co he's coming on the right-hand side. Okay, this might... 
Uh, abort! Abort! It's minions! Okay, I'm not going to get his King Tower. For the first, you probably won't have seen me have to change sides, but this is the way it's going to have to be. We're changing sides. I'm no longer going for the King Tower. I'm going to go for his tower. We're going to go for the two crown win. I don't think I could have beaten those barbarians and that wizard. Let's do this! Send everyone! Right hand lane, his arrows are not going to stop me. Fireball onto this wizard and these barbs. He's going to go down. I think we got him. We got his tower. He's only got eight seconds to respond. He's got no chance. Let's get this giant in anyway. Goblin barrel. We can stop that. He's not got the time. Two seconds. One second. Nice. First win in Arena 5. Wow, it's getting harder and harder, guys. No three crown win that time. Yikes. Okay, guys, I will be back a little bit later. I'm going to show you what other people are doing with low-level accounts pushing higher, even higher than this. I'm going to try and push up to Arena 6. And hopefully I'll show you how to replace the witch. Thank you guys for watching. Also, thank you for the 150,000 subscribers. The last 10k came up so much quicker than I was expecting. So, I've got a special video getting ready for you guys. But I just want a big shout out to it. I've got so many subscribers. This You guys are so loyal. You've been, I know that some of you guys are not even playing Clash anymore. And you're still watching the videos. That means a lot to me. So, you guys, thank you for everything, and I promise I'll bring you an awesome 150k special. Send everyone!